hello everyone thank you very much for watching my videos today in this video we are going to talk about a very important topic which is known as a web app or a web application we are going to create our web application with the help of google app script so for this particular video i am going to explain you what are the basic requirements of a web app when you are building it in google app script and in my second upcoming part i am going to introduce you with a more complex part in the web application so let's start so before creating a web application we have to answer four questions one is what type of application i'm going to create what is the code i have to write how my web application page will look like and how i'm going to deploy and test it right so Point number one, type web application. For example, uh, if I talk about Wikipedia.com, in which a user will see the information, he will read the information, and he will just go away, right? But there are other type of applications which are usually in uh, the case. User will come to the page and interact with the page. For example, uh, for example, SBI.com, ICIC.com, and other websites. So all websites, anything which is on internet, is a web application. So today we are going to learn how to create a web applications which uh, which only provide the information and you cannot interact with the website. Okay, so let's begin. I'll go to extension here in the Google Sheet. Okay, I'll go to App Script, and when you click on this, uh, you will get this type of page where my code is written in this. Okay, code dot js. and i have created one html page here this second page so how we can create an html page you will go to this plus sign and create and click on html so it will give you it will basically give you the basic structure of the html let's just uh, create one sample okay see this is already created now so anything you want or how your web page will look like right you are going to write the code here and everything else will remain same okay i'm just deleting this cool so as you can see what i have written here is this this body and this body is same it was already provided by the interface i have entered these four lines i have copy pasted this information from wikipedia so i have put this information between two paragraph tags which are a very standard uh, notation in html uh, language if you are not aware of, about the html tags i would recommend go and learn what are heading tags what are paragraph tags how we can input the information and how how to create a button so these three four items are very basic in nature and these are very important to create a web application so in this i am using two types of tags one in h1 that means the main heading tag okay and whenever you start a tag you have to close it like this with a slash sign right forward slash so article colon the internet will be the heading of the page my of my web page and this will be the normal paragraph in my web page so i have created this cool now i want to publish this particular information in a html format and for that i will go to code.js and i'll write do get and then i'm going to write return html service dot create html output file and i'm going to give the name of the file this file name okay this file name when i will uh, deploy this uh, it will automatically take the information from this page and it will present you uh, let's learn how to deploy this so we have a deploy option here we'll just click there here is a deploy button click on new deployment give some name to it for example sample 1 okay myself anyone and anyone with google account so who has access so if you are testing keep it to myself and if you are going to share it your web application is complete you want to share it with anyone right all the all the users you can just put anyone and you can just share the link so for for this particular video i'm keeping it to only myself and then deploy when you click you will get the url of the web application i'll just copy this url done and i'll just go and open this url it will give me the page like this article the internet 
so this is a very simple web application so in this video you have learned what are the basic requirements to publish an app okay so do get is a very important text here and this line is very important to make google app script understand that what you have to do with this html page you have to create an html output file with the help of html service right and this is our html page so in my next video i'm going to create an attendance system where user will come and will click on the punch button and the data will get recorded in the back end of the web app web app back end the name the username the time date and everything and slowly slowly we are going to build a proper attendance system where wages can be calculated and everything will be calculated i hope you understood the concept how to create a web app with the help of google app script please tune in and be ready for my next video thank you very